So it's your boy, Downsizing. I'm back once again on my block with another hood classic. Manuel Cricket Madrano. Why did you lie to the public online, to your viewers on your channel about me, my homies, the Arizona Mexican Mafia, and your own personal story? Why did you lie about us? Why have you led your viewing audience, your subscribers to believe all of these lies about me, the Arizona Mexican mafia, my homies and yourself? When the story you told about why you stepped out and all this other stuff isn't true. I exposed the fact that you, that you ratted on my homie Dino, that you made a deal with the state, the government, the federal government, that you testified in several cases, that you set a female up in Casa Grande for some kilos of cocaine for the federal government. And now that, now that we've come full circle on these Greyhound interviews, that you used to love and gloat and glory over. Did you see my Greyhound interview? Did you see my Greyhound interview? For years, you trolled about that. For years, you ran the numbers up on that video based on those lies and that deception and your own deceit. It is known that you had to delete the very first videos you put out about the Arizona Mexican Mafia in its history because you lied. We all know that you had to delete the videos about RJ and David because you lied. And when you got Greyhound on there to talk shit about me, you lied. You're a lying thief. You have no credibility. Validate it. You were a member for merely three months. These are the facts. These details are described in the paperwork. Now, never mind all of that. Are you ever going to be man enough to admit your fault? Will you ever be man enough to apologize? Or will, you in, or will you continue to be a mouse? You've been grifting on a memory on here for years. Memory that's fictitious. You've established, you've established a following and validation and accreditation based on my homie coming on there and doing what he did. And now, and now we come full circle to him, for him to prove that you lied, that you're a lying thief, that you've been doing nothing but spreading rumors off on your platform. You've been lying on all of us over here making us all look bad. You lie. You continue to lie. You led all those people who watch you to believe that you were somebody you're not. You still mislead them into believing that, that you're something you're not, that you're active, you got reach, you're here. When you're in federal witness protection program because you snitched on my homies. Now think about it. I've been running live on location demonstrating clearly my activity, how active I am here. You forgot all the people 
been named by me here. You forgot all the different locations I pulled up at here and the people that have been present at them locations here. You ain't going to never be. You ain't going to never be on par with no one here. How a little rat like you managed to get in where you fit in. You know how? I wasn't there no more. Paul did the same. Paul and Angel did the same shit you did. Snake shit you did. Lied on my name. You're a fucking lying thief. You see, because if I was still there you would have never been able to get made. You would have never been able to get made. And all of these moves that these fools made against my homies would have never, never been played. But we see now, huh? How, full, how it comes full circle and where we all stand at now, you see, huh? Everybody has to see. At some point, they'll awaken that call to personalities would dispel and disperse because you forget you gained all of that from lying. You have no credibility. Those people have itching ears. They believe a lie or otherwise they would know better. You preyed upon that. You preyed upon the weak those gullible naive people who subscribed to a lie and liars and I'm going to leave you with that I'm going to leave you to lie in your own deceit your own denial until your death and be careful out here you come again Peace and a